another attack that's terrified Ukrainians and horrified the world. It was the middle of the afternoon when the missiles hit. A fire ripping through this busy supermarket and shopping center in central Ukraine. The flames hindered rescuers and soldiers from reaching people feared trapped in the rubble. A senior government advisor was one of the first on the scene. I'm standing at the site of yet another of Putin's vile and cynical attacks on the peaceful Ukrainians. I'm in Kremenchuk. Behind me is burned down Amstor supermarket where people were grocery shopping. It was never a military object. The strike comes just a day after Russian missiles devastated two residential buildings in the capital, Kyiv. A nursery school playground was hit in the same attack. The Kremlin continues to say it is not targeting civilians, but these indiscriminate strikes continue to happen. And in this instance, President Zelensky said there were more than a thousand people inside the shopping center. Fortunately, as far as we know now, many people managed to get out before the strike. They were assisted out after the air raid siren, but there were still people inside when it hit, employees and some visitors. Only terrorists who have no place on earth could strike on such a location. This is not a mistaken missile strike, it is a calculated Russian strike on this shopping center. The timing of these bombings could be a power play by Russia to world leaders at the G7 summit in Germany. But the civilian casualties may instead strengthen President Zelensky's hand as he calls for air defense systems and more urgent support. Meanwhile, Ukrainians are living in a state of terror, not knowing what or where will be hit next.